we'll see what this is like. So the idea of a bird dating sim is is pretty cute. Just gonna check my streaming stuff seems to be working. So this looks pretty amazing. I'm glad that I, I purchased this already. Um, let's start a new game. I'm going to be reading all the text here as well. Welcome to Saint Pigeon Nations. Please enter your name. Okay, well I'll be PJF. Oh. Actually, can I do Japanese input? No. Okay, well, I'm going to be Poru. Um, when I go to Japan, Paul is really hard to pronounce, so Poru is uh, essentially the Japanese fired version of my name. Let's go with my actual surname. Well, let's Japanese fired. Benu. Because obviously this is from Japan, like, as if this would be from anywhere else in the world. Hutterfall Boyfriend includes a powerful visualization model, allowing even the birdiest of birds to appear as normal humans when first introduced. Display human portraits. Okay, so... So uh, I have in the chat room here that um, uh, Leon is having a fire drill. Um, do I want to display human portraits? I have no idea. Um, I'm guessing so for like the the full experience, so we can have like some sort of compatibility between uh, humans and birds in terms of attractiveness or something. I have no idea if this is a good idea or not. We'll find out. St. Pigeon Nations, a school blessed with extensive curricula and facilities. Sounds great so far. It's already been a year since I ended my ordinary life and walked through these gates. I should probably say, this school is known for one thing in particular. This school is Japan's, no, the world's greatest gathering place for gifted birds. Birds who want to study the arts, the sciences, even sports all come to St. Pigeon Nations. The teaching staff and student body are both made up of a diverse blend of birds of different backgrounds and species. I'm often asked why I chose to come here, despite not being a bird. It is a long story. Not every day I see you rushing along like this. It's Ryota. Ryota. Usually you'd have been ready for an hour by now, Poru. Overslept. <laughs> this rock dove is named Karara Ryota. We've been friends since he was barely hatched. He can be a little mischievous, but he's responsible and kind. Breakfast was a little hard to catch today. I can't relax without red meat inside. Living as a hunter-gatherer sounds tough. I'd be happy to make you breakfast, you know. I might take you up on that starvation, on that offer when starvation lives. Thanks, Riota. I have no idea as a human what I would be catching for breakfast, but I'm guessing some small furry mammal, maybe a lizard. Oh, the bell already. Come on, we need to hurry to class. Jeepers, no good being late on the first day. Oh I'm going to lower the desktop audio a bit. And so Riolta pulled me along into the school. Today is the start of a new semester. I wonder what lies in store. It was all I could do to adjust to the atmosphere last year, 
better make up for all that lost fun. How to Fall Boyfriend The most splendid and greatest academy of the pigeon, by the pigeon, and for the pigeon. Which is interesting because that was also the, uh, the Pearl Conference uh, motto um, in Japan that I went to, except instead of pigeon it was developer. But um, that's jolly good. Oops. I'm just checking my diagnostics to make sure we're streaming okay. I think that we're in 2-3. Ryota and I are in the same class again. Old faces, new faces. A strange thrill as my heart as fills a strange thrill fills my heart as I look around at the assembled birds. I hope we all get along. Here's to the formation of very many happy memories. Oh, this is lovely so far. Oh, the teacher's here. <laughs> it's Kazuaki, the teacher. Good morning, everybody. <laughs> uh I'm Nanaki Kazuaki. I seem to be your teacher this year. Obviously, that's a surprise. I specialize in math and da, 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 physics and and also some other things. Wow, this is sounding suspenseful already. Zzz. Sir, wake up. It's homeroom. He sleeps with his eyes open. And so here we have um, our teacher, uh, Kazuyaki Nanaki. <laughs> I'm not sure if I want the human portraits on or not. Um, I feel it's better without them, but I'm sure that's something which can be configured. This quail is Nanaki Kazuaki. He's a famous, famously soporific maths professor. I'd heard the rumors, but I hadn't expected him to fall asleep. Just like that. Apparently, he's well known as a mathematician. Just to show, great minds come in all forms. Ah, I'm sorry. Isn't it a little warm in here? Which reminds me, we have a transfer student. Please, introduce yourself, Shirogane. What's the point? I have no wish to speak with commoners. Do not think that I am here because I wish to be. Oh, well, I guess that's that. Hey, 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 that's no good. But he doesn't want to introduce himself. But we can't just let him break the rules like that, sir. The system will collapse and we'll all turn into kul kulaks and dissenters. Okay, so just for the record here, um, I'm totally fine with people breaking rules. Um, I, I don't know, I'm more sort of uh, neutral good, chaotic good in, in alignment. But clearly my bird entity is not. Well, when you put it like that, could you at least say your name, Shiragane? <laughs> Shiragane Lebel Sakuya. It seems this fan tail is Shirogani Sakuya. His feathers would make any birdie proud. I can't believe any birdie is a is a a word. He's pretty stuck up, but then transferring is never easy. I hope we can be friends. Sakuya sits down, glaring daggers at Ryota and me, because there's only three of us in class, clearly. I think this little bird is telling me there's going to be trouble down the line. Oh my goodness, it's lunch already. We didn't do any maths whatsoever. Today is slipping by so quickly. And that reminds me, I've had these books out from the library all summer. I'll return them now, because fines are a terrible thing. Where is everyone? Aside from the receptionist, there's hardly anybody here. Huh? Is somebody looking at me? That's probably just my imagination. 
or not, a morning dove stands in a dark corner, staring in my direction. Oh no, we've got like a creepy librarian. Morning doves aren't very common in Japan, but apparently they're everywhere in America. Um, did you want something from me? He looked away. Not really. I'm pretty sure it was him who I felt looking at me. There's no one else here. Are you sure? Yes. I don't want anything with you. It's the things that you're carrying that I'm interested in. He glances at the desk as if to say, Hurry up, return them already. Oh, sorry. <laughs> They're a little too dense, I, I never finish them. Were you waiting for them all summer? Hmm. He silently returns his gaze to his book. Maybe he's in a bad mood. Uh, Watashi no Nameya wa Fenuiku Poru desu, a sophomore. How about you? Your... Hmm. Nageki. Fujishiro. Fujishiro Nageki. Freshman. <laughs> okay, I'm going to turn off the human portraits when I get a chance, because I think it's beautiful just having the birds. <laughs> Fujishiro Nageki, huh? Morning doves are pretty rare in Japan. Oh, great way to be racist, like, right off the bat. Maybe it's just his voice, but he seems kind of sad. Leave me alone. He's reading his book again. Okay, sorry to bother you. I keep meeting depressing people today. Now that I have that out of the way, I think I'll head back to class. Wait, isn't that... Dum dum dum! It's Sakuya! You should have been instructed not to approach me in school. Come on, Sakuya. What kind of thing is that to say to your own brother? After all these years? My brother? You must be joking. I never once been a brother to me. Oh, please. Don't try to talk to me again. I've no time for half-breeds. I'll be going now. Hey! Wait just a... I guess even if we're in the same school now, what's done is done. I hadn't meant to eavesdrop, but I think I just overheard something juicy. The ever-popular trendsetter and ladies' man, Saka... Sakazaki Yuya is Sakuya's brother? I wonder what the story behind that is. Hey. <gasps> you heard that whole thing, right? Are you a friend of Sakuya's? Uh, 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 I'm sorry. I, I didn't mean to listen in on you. <laughs> no sweat. I try to stay sexy and suave in front of all you little ladies, but that there wasn't too cool. <laughs> this fantail pigeon is Sakazaki Yuya, an upperclassman. I've never talked to him before, but he's famous or infamous throughout the school. Everybody knows him. You're Poru, right? Uh, how did you... I know everybody here. Besides, you're the only human. A single poppy in a field of rye. Did you say that you're a friend of Sakuya's? Not exactly. We had a rather ballistic introduction this morning. We're in the same class, that's all. I'd never have thought that stuck-up aristocrat wannabe was your brother. <laughs> aristocrat wannabe? He is an aristocrat, actually. Genuine article. In the flesh. 
he is. He's a bit of a pain, so good luck, Monami. Adieu. Oh, he really is a noble bird. So I think we have like a prime love interest at this point. I've never heard anything like that about Yuya though. Probably a twisty business. That's it for today. Stay safe, everyone. Yay! Huh? Sir, where's Ryota? He said he was going to the infirmary. Maybe you should go and see if he's still there. <gasps> oh no, Ryota's sick! Now that I think about it, Ryota always did have a weak stomach. I should go to the infirmary just to make sure he's okay. Excuse me. Nobody's here. There's no one sleeping behind the curtains, and the doctor isn't here either. My hunter-gatherer instincts feel no presence, because I have human superpowers. There's nobody here. Riota? No reply. The infirmary is empty. Weird. Did he go home already? I feel a little nervous poking around the empty room. Now that I think of it, I haven't been in here much before. I'm like Ryota. I'm perfectly healthy. Whoa! They've got all kind of drugs in here! Ethylpar, Trifi, Lucio Benzene. What do these things even do? Care to find out? D -d 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 Doctor? Oh no, that's his name. Shu is his name. I'll feed you all sorts of things if you want. Hmm? This is not a responsible school doctor. No, thank you. <laughs> this partridge is Iwamine Shu, the school doctor. He's rather creepy in person and has a bad reputation among the student body. Everybody knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with this, with this, oh man, I'm terrible with medical names. With, everybody knows that even just talking to him can bring you down with a spilgus, pisoticosis, or even worse things. And I never even heard of him coming through the door. Maybe he's a ninja doctor. You don't look like you have a good reason to be in here. Did you need something? Um, I heard Ryota Kawara from 2 to 3 was supposed to be here. Oh, him? He's already gone. Oh. Why didn't he come and find me before going home? He's failing as a friend. Uh, so, sorry to bother you. I'll be going now. Finally out of that den of evil. Ryota's already gone home. What do I do now? Oh! I never got around to joining a club last year. Maybe I'll go take a look at some of my options. I think there are clubs for baseball, soccer, track, kendo, migration, <laughs> bird watching. Wasn't there another one? Anyway, I'll start with the track team. I ran in middle school. And it's always funny watching the birds hop around. I think the club room is on the ground floor, off to the side. A white dove is having a tantrum outside. This is no pudding for a man! Okosan rejects it! It is a lie! A vicious falsification! He's dancing around on a squished pudding. Hey, that's not very nice of the pudding. <laughs> this is Okosan. He doesn't really look it, but supposedly he's a fantail pigeon. I think. Either way, he's hyper. Cool. 
Okasan has suffered a, de a deception most vile, a wretched betrayal. A betrayal? Oh. Okasan instructed that pudding be provided for new members. But this is no pudding. Ousted, scorned, betrayed, dragged into the street and shot by those he trusted most. It is squished and filthy, but the thing under his feet looks like normal store-bought pudding. What's wrong with it? Go, go. Oh, spare the jests, young lady. Okasan used wing attack. It's super effective. They will rue the day when they crossed Okasan. He'll have them flayed, hang, shot at dawn. He will. Okasan must now train to achieve true pudding. Farewell. And he's gone. He's a good runner, but what does pudding have to do with the track team? And so ended the first day of my second semester at St. Pigeon Nations. So, at the end of the first day, I think that I should be saving. I assume that's what this does here. Save. And, um, I'm going to adjust those preferences as well. Oh. I can't turn off the bird portraits. It's apparently a, a permanent thing. But, um... Having finished the first day, I'm going to take a break, um, make sure that all of my video stuff is going through, and then maybe a little bit later on, I will continue playing this. I'm going to play the whole game online on Twitch, so you won't miss anything. There will always be the previous videos available. So thank you very much for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. <laughs>